Hello, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Metal 7 Game. We're playing Battletech. We are playing the Battletech Extended 3025 Commander's Edition full game mod, uh, and we're fighting the clans. So, um, everything's healed. Everything's repaired. All the changes we've done are good. We finished the. Um, what did we finish? We finished something. Uh, hydroponics garden, maybe. Uh, I think we finished the hydroponics garden. I think I'm kind of done messing with this. Uh, we could do another habitat pod. We could do some more stuff to help with our our. Uh, you know, our morale and that sort of stuff, but eh, you know, we may as well, I guess. We've got it. Um, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna pause. I want to get us back up to 380 mil. You know, we're we're what one mil down from that? 378968. Let's see if we can get back up there, and then maybe we spend some more money, right? But we're we we've, we've been spending money that you know isn't necessarily ours. So um, let's take a look at the uh, command center, and I think we take one of these one and a half skulls. So we've got the liberator here. Uh, for the Steiners who don't hate us. Um, we've got a couple missions there. We've got a destroy base and a battle. Uh, we've got this rolling thunder one that pays a little bit better. And we've got a two skull as well for Kirita, a destroy base. But I think I want to do this one, just a regular battle in the Highlands. They pay slightly better than everybody else, which may be a good thing, bad thing, I don't know. Um, we can get one of five and 437, or we can get one of four and take the 750. Uh, with our stated goal of getting back up to 380, we're going to take the one of four. We're only allowed to grab one anyway, so, you know, we may as well do it that way. Um, we decided the Marauder was coming out of the list and that the Mad Cat was going in. We've got the Ryokan in here and then the Vindicator in here. I think this is the one that we have more problems with getting stuck in places. We'll see if uh, I screwed that up right there. Um, Kevlar's done fine, but I think Solitaire goes back into his Vindicator. Maybe we'll go ahead and let Kevlar... Um, she have? She's got... Her footing, evasive expert. Um, yeah, well, let's go ahead and give her the reopen. Let's let's give her something there. Um, Taskmaster's out. We'll put Tanith back in. Uh, who got the Mad Cat? Punchy got the Mad Cat. Um, yeah, I'm okay with that. I think that's fine. Um, no, you know what? Swank hasn't had a whole lot of runs. Let's go ahead and throw Swank in there. Swank has uh, breaching shot, her footing, and multi-target. So let's go for that. Just because we haven't we haven't given her a go. Right? She hasn't had a lot of chances. All right. We have an opportunity for willing mercenaries, Commander. Not quite sure what that sentence means. Plan Wolf Force is the target of our mission, but we realize the target is beyond the capability of the force we have available. We need you to be the backup to Merrick forces to make a start for to make a start to further operations. We expect significant opposition, which is where you come in. So maybe we're going to get some help here. I mean, it kind of reads like there'll be a Merrick force on the ground as well that we will not have to fight with. We'll see how that goes, or if it is true at all. All right, Commander, my spirits inform me that you are our support. Glad to have you along. Once we learn it, we'll presume to our own evac LZ. All right. Uh, this is our go actual. You are green to engage. Hey, he actually used a little bit of actual language. Uh, Commander, we are under no obligation to keep these people alive, but there's a bonus in it if we do. All right. Uh, what did they bring? Uh, let's come in here real fast. They've got a Warhammer, an Awesome, a Phoenix Hawk, and a Wasp. Okay. Not too bad. Uh, we're going to hop in in Solitaire and our Scout Mech. Uh, and I'm going to print to there. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Nothing yet. Okay. Uh, Battlemaster. Kind of same type of deal. Let's kind of copy. Just sprint up. Maybe we'll go this way with him. Mad Cat kind of in the center of the line there, with the Zeus next to him. I'm there. And the Ryokin will kind of slide in maybe right here. All right, they're going to sprint forward as well. Or at least move forward. All right, the Wasp got caught. Or Phoenix Hawk got caught. Nice. Okay, so the question is where? There. All right, I'm going to reserve. The Ryokin can wait. We'll see if one of these people can come up and actually get us a target. Blackhawk, okay. 
We got somebody coming down here too. One, two, three, four. All right. So what do we? What can we see so far? Um, we've got a dragonfly. We've got a blackhawk. Okay. So, Kevlar. Why don't you? Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to slide this way. We're going to put leave those guys in the front. I'm going to slide this way. We'll come over here. We'll see who the shot is. Probably. Yeah, he's going to be close range. I think he'll go after them. So let's go ahead and go after this Blackhawk with the ERPPCs. And we'll go ahead and just take some shots. He's pretty well bunkered in there, but we did hit that arm pretty good. Okay. All right. And target locks on them. That's fine. We don't care about that. Location confirmed. Slide over here with the Mad Cat. First shot in anger. So we've got a Fenris over there. Or well, we've got the Black Hawk up here. Better shot. Let's take the Black Hawk. We've already done some damage to him anyway. Again, we're into the armor, or into that arm. Into the structure on that arm. There's a Puma. Okay. We've gone after the Wasp. I hear you. Um, I'm just going to kind of, I'm going to go to here with On the Vindy. I don't think we're the target at the moment, so we may as well get that PPC. Um, yeah. Firing everything I've got. I mean, why not, right? As long as we have kind of a wall of people in front of us at the moment. Slide the awesome around as well. And I think we just keep up on the Blackhawk. There we go. Good shots on him. Oh, yeah. Knocked down and he's lost one of his PPCs. That was good. All right. Ryokin just stepped out and crushed whatever that was. Was that their Shadowhawk or the Wasp? I think that's the Wasp. Got a mech down. Targo actual, copy commander, they won't be able to take much more. Well, then they should stop standing in front in the open like morons. I mean, that's... Up, no. That's my opinion. We'll just keep sidestepping okay, here. Okay, let's go. All right, we got the Puma there. We got the Ryokin there. Um, the Fenris there. We can no longer see the other guys, so... Let's see. 48, 48... Got 575, 910, 720. I think we go for the Puma. He just doesn't have as much armor. So let's see if we can take him out. We got a hit in there. What does the Warhammer go for? He went for the Fenris. Okay. It's awfully dug in over there. Somebody's doing something. In theory, they're thinking about it. Oh, there he goes. Black Hawk got up, looks like. The question is, do we ignore him now? I mean, he does still have a PPC. Uh, yep. Is it worth just finishing him off? So. Because we are going to come in on that side, which is pretty good. But just with the LRMs. what we could do a little bit on. Fenris we could do a little bit on. I'm kind of thinking I go multi-target. We go Black Hawk with the LRMs and then we put everything else over here on the Puma. Here we go. Hey, we just try to soften him up. There's, you know, not a lot going on, but hey, we got a new arm there. All right. Awesome gets up there and did some good damage to that Black Hawk. We can pretty much ignore him now. He's what, a medium laser left is all? So I'm going to ignore him. Uh, inbound broadsword with Clan Wolf. All right, so they've got reinforcements coming in. That's going to be trouble. Yes, Commander. Means we really kind of want to start finishing guys off. Um, 
you know, not worried about him. The Ryokan would be good. The Puma. Um, and I'm going to do a precision strike on the Puma. Um, I'll go for that shoulder. See if we can cut out some of that firepower. Got rid of a large pulse. Got a medium. Okay. Scored a critical hit. Something. Be nice if we get the Black Hawk and a Puma off the table this time. I mean, again, he's just a medium pulse. It's not a big deal, but uh, it'd be nice. I expect the AI will go for him. I've been center locked. Yeah, well, welcome to the club. Ready for orders. Uh, Dragonfly, Ryokin. All right, so let's go ahead and multi-target. So we're gonna we're gonna put the big stuff up on the Puma. Again, we'll see if we can finish him off. And we'll put all the little stuff down here on the Dragonfly. Acknowledged. Got a knockdown. That's something. And we've got a couple hits on the Dragonfly. Who's going to move first? Got options. It's thinking about him. Fenris runs over and takes a shot at the wasp. Okay. Light on light action there. Waiting on you, Commander. Uh, nope. Where is that Puma? There he is. Oh, that stump. But we at least did get in there with the missiles. Another hit like that, and you're toast. Although to be fair, they weren't great hit chances. You know, 50-50 essentially. So we can't complain. Worked out okay. All right, Ryokin. Who's he going for? Go right after the wasp. Okay, fine with that. Yes, Commander. Puma, you're done, buddy. I hope. All right, so he's out. Good. Um, and because we can move, on, want to go here? No, it's not gonna let me. And I go. I don't know if it's because the computer's just on just a little. I was just trying to sidestep a little after that shot. That's all. There we go. Just didn't want to let me click over there. Okay. Blackheart comes down, takes a shot at the tor at the wasp. We can maybe finish him right now. I'm here. Uh, we have reasonable shots there, but I think again, let's just take bodies off the table, or just miss him completely everywhere. Yeah, uh... Come on, Warhammer, finish him for me. There we go. Nice. And took a shot at the Dragonfly as well. Take off one of those evasions. Good job. And another one at the Fenris. Nice job using all those weapons of multi-shot. What are your orders, Skip? Like that. Um... I think I'm actually gonna step up a little bit here. Here. Copy that, Commander. So we can use the medium lasers. So what do we got going on? We got reasonable, not quite as good. I'm gonna put the, yeah, let's go multi-shot. So let's go ahead and put the missiles on the reopening back there since he's hiding back there. And 66% not terrible. And we'll put everything else maybe on this little guy right here. We'll go after the dragonfly. So it, we don't have to get a lot of shots into that dragonfly to get him. You know, um, just about anything's going to be significant. So he's down already almost 200 armor. There are also one after the reopen. They had a good shot from the side there. Nice. That was a lot of damage. That'll help a lot. Okay, reinforcements are coming. We expected that. 
fine. Commander. It's not amazing, but you know what? We'll we'll deal with what we deal with. Um, can I can I move? Uh, it's still giving me problems here. Let's try this again. Move. No, I can't move. Um, interesting. It told me I could, but then it didn't actually let me do it. All right, so, nope. Nope. All we can do is shoot. It's not letting us do anything else here, so we may as well. Um, Dragonfly, Fenris, Ryokin? What if we go in here? He's got that AC-20. We'll go after that shoulder. Well, we took off a lot of armor, and that's about it. Now, I don't know if that means they're all lights or they're just all really fast. Find out in a minute. What is the watch doing? He's just moving. Okay. Gain evasive. Get into cover. Get in a Blackhawk. Puma. Fenris. Uh, we can't zoom a little bit. We can do everything or nothing, it looks like. Um, Fenris. Ryokin, Puma, Blackhawk, Dragonfly. Okay. Waiting for orders. All right, what do we got with the Mad Cat? Oh, uh, that's pretty good. I'm kind of thinking we might want to take that. That Blackhawk is not too bad either. 76. 81 on that Ryokin. 71 on that Fenris. I think these are good, though. I was kind of thinking about putting the PPCs over there. Um, but I think we'll just go all in right here. Let's take care of the, the guy in front of us and not do much damage to him, despite all that. And now wait for somebody to move. Who knows who? A lot of thinking for the computer to do here. And they still got, this is what, our little dude that ran away? Is that a dragonfly, maybe? All right. Uh, Fenris. Came in after the Warhammer. Oh, and that's the Fenris. Yeah, I think that's the dragonfly. I hear you. I didn't think it was 40 tons, but okay. Pretty. Again, moving doesn't seem to be an option. 71% on that. Can we multi-target? We can't. Um, I mean, realistically, I had a green number in there somewhere, didn't I? Realistically, this is probably the best bet. He stayed out of the fight for the most part. He's clearly shooting, though, because he's got heat. So I'm going to put the LRMs there. Let's see if we can take off a shoulder or an arm. Or... He's right there. You know, we got him down about 300 armor so far. The two Ryokans are probably the most dangerous thing we've got out there. See what happens here. All right, just moving forward. French guarded all that good sort of stuff. Couple more to go. All right, everybody's just moving up this turn. Honestly, I'm really surprised that the uh, Merrick hasn't lost a, another unit or two. I mean, he he ran up there and just was dumb. But um, the Wasp is still kicking. Nothing else has really taken much of a shot. Been kind of lucky that that Loki hid back there. Okay, one more guy moved up. They're all kind of hiding in the, the lee of the hill right Commander. there. Who do we got? We go there. We go there. No, I think I'm going to try to move here. Here. Get us some more okay. options. Let's see who we want to shoot here. So, reasonable with the Fenris. Dragonfly is about the same. Fenris right... None of those are... That's not terrible with the Blackhawk. Okay. I mean, I'm kind of thinking we go for the Fenris in front of us. 
Just because we gave him all the guns on him. It'd be nice if we could, um... Giving him everything precision I've shoot him, but that's okay. We did some damage. And this one is just crawling. This 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 one is. I don't think it's stressing the computer quite as much. It just isn't. It's just taking a while to go through the code, I think, because the fans aren't going. So, at least from a GPU standpoint, probably we're not generating a lot of heat. I don't know CPU we are either. Hey. Um. Yeah, I think we just stay here. I'm sorry, dude. I hope you Your primary for the moment. Okay, there goes a the streak. I would rather got the PPC I'm off, but you know. We got a knockdown. Good enough. Something. So many guys left to kill. That's the problem. All right, Warhammer. Can you finish him off? Yes, you can. Good job. That Warhammer's doing a great job of finishing when we start. Really like the support from him. Ready to rock. Uh, I go this. Go this way and go get another shot at him. Zeus. I get a straight shot at him? Only if I move out of the trees. I think I'm going to do it. I think he's also injured. I don't want him coming back in. That dragonfly. Eh. Not really a very good shot. I don't really have good shots anywhere, though. We'll just take it. You know, if we would have got lucky with a PPC or something, it would have been fine. We didn't. Um, we hit with some missiles, and that's about it. Where's the awesome going? We went after the dragonfly. Okay, the new one. Orders. Um. Hey, okay. hold on. If I go here, oh, I just don't have the facing. There we go. We don't really need to move. We just need the facing. Again, I think I'm going to stay. Well, let's see. Those are 36. Not good, that's not good, that's not great, that's not great. Yeah, I think this is as good as it's going to get. And I will use my precision strike here, and we'll go for that shoulder. See if we can bust through there, start doing some damage. Yeah, there we go. Ammo's gone, torso, arm's gone. He's, he's unsteady. We've got the other dude hiding around the corner there, it looks like. Okay. They're gonna. Is that the Loki still back there? It might be the Loki. Yep. There was that AC 20. I saw the 100. He hit with it. But now he's out in the open. Fine. You, you lured him out. Good job. Good job. Um, Mad Cat. We go here. Move order received. I think we're going after this dude now. I think, yeah, that's the that's the ticket. Taking shot. Yeah, that was nice of him to walk out of there. We we crushed him. That was a big hit. Ahead. I'd say we that AC twenty was probably the most dangerous thing on the map still. Um, depending on what's in that one, <laughs> I don't know what's in that reopen. Um, well, let me look. I've clicked on him about six times, but it just wants to show me the Warhammer. Try one more time. Uh, he's ERs. Okay, mediums and large. Okay, yeah, no, he's definitely the, the nastiest thing on the table. Indicator. Um, if we hop, can we hop to here and get a direct shot at you? Yeah, let's do that. We can get more use out of this PPC than I thought we were going to. We even hit with it that time. It didn't look like we did, but we did. Either incapacitated. Ryokin goes down. All we've got left on that side is, is whatever, the dragonfly. So I'm not as worried about it. He's a lot of machine guns. He's all close-up stuff. But we probably now work on the next Ryokin. I think that's probably our next primary. Although he's not the scariest Ryokin, so maybe we look and see if somebody else's, you know, They've got a sensor lock on weapons you. to armament, you know, is a better, better bet for us. Okay, they went after our Ryokin. Fine. Like everybody's gonna end up up on that hill, so we should have reasonable shots at people. Well, 
One more fast mover to go. Then we'll get to shoot somebody, hopefully. Okay, we've gone after the Zeus. He's taking a little bit of a beating here now. Standing by. We're gonna go ahead and walk the awesome up. Make him a target up here. See who we got. All right, so we've got the Ryokin there. Um, the Dragonfly has a PPC. He's actually a really good target. 650 armor. The Puma has two PPCs. He's not as good a target. But he doesn't have a lot of armor. Blackhawk also. PPCs. Okay, so I would say the Ryokin maybe isn't the target I would say is. I'm going to go for the Dragonfly first. Um, he's got at least armor over there. Excuse me. I've got five guns that all have a shot at him. They're reasonable. And he's got a PPC. Targeting for an alpha strike. He no longer has a PPC. Reporting critical hit. All right, next. <laughs> and we have to move the Zeus maybe back to here somewhere. If I was that guy, I might run in and take the chance with all the machine guns and stuff he used to have. I don't know what he's got that's still active, but... He's not in the trees there, which is why they're going for him. I said that would be the shot. Uh, just to go with the medium lasers, though. All right, one more dude over here. Puma goes after their Warhammer. Oh, right leg destroyed. Okay, well, that could be bad for him. Well, I take it back. He was already up here. Um, and they don't, they only got one more guy, so he'll get a chance to stand up. Actually, that was it, so he will have the chance to stand up. He'll be fine. Um, now I can come back over here to try to finish off this guy. Um, go to, but I don't know that I need to. Put it here. I can see everybody, and we'll take a shot. We'll figure out what we want. So if we go here, eh. Good shots with that. Good shots. So if we go multi-target, and we go after... That dragonfly's already lost an arm, right? Yeah. Let's go, after the, let's go after the Black Hawk next. And then we go over here with the small weapons. Okay. Okay, we've got a straight shot in there, so we hit a couple people. Missed everything there, but we did take an evasion down. All right, my turn again. Confirm. And once again, we want to move this dude back. Um... Go to here. You can kind of see them or them. Um, you can go this way. Move order received. Slide them back here. We'll face them. We're in the trees. We got the Ryokin. We got the Dragonfly. We got the Fenris back over there. We got the Black Hawk who we went after last time. Let's keep the pressure up on him. And as long as they're all in there, we're getting some stray shots on people, too. So we're not really losing much. We're just not maybe being as effective as we could be. But I think that's okay. So they've got the Warhammer. I'm assuming he's going to stand up right there. Maybe just back up into the trees a little bit. He can take a shot. He does. Got a hit on somebody. Maybe one of the Poom. Uh, no, it's the Ryokin, I think, right? They're all kind of ugly. The Awesome goes after the Black Hawk with us. Nice. Followed our lead. Took a lot of armor off that dude. That worked out okay. Um, I think our Ryokin um, kind of probably continues that. Dragonfly. I'm not worried about him. Not worried about him. I'm thinking I want that Blackhawk. Although those are really crappy shots. 34, 29, 34. I think we go after the Ryokin instead just because they're better shots. We'll turn off all the LR5s. Um, we'll go ahead and use a precise strike. Get ourselves a slightly better one. Um, go for a side torso. Let's see if we can take one out. Eh. 
We did something. So they've still got six mechs on the board. <laughs> the wasp is still up and kicking. Couple shots at the puma, nice. We sure didn't do much damage to it. Did they have two pumas in there? I don't remember. And say so that one hasn't taken much damage. If that was That was when we were shooting out, we, we were pretty sad. Okay. We got four people this turn, so let's see what they do. Nor's our Vindicator. Just comes running in from into the trees. Okay. Commander. Um I'm kinda wondering if we just finish him. We do so without completely giving my back away. Okay. Now it's showing us that we have this. On it. I hope so, because we've just given up our back. Firing full complement on enemies. We didn't finish him, damn it. Maybe we can hop the Vindicator over and do it. Maybe even hop the Vindicator up here and shoot down into him. That might be a good idea. I have to see where things... I don't think much of this is going to affect us. Initially. Okay, he's just gone and sensor locked people. Good. I like that. That's good. All of them can do that. Alright, so this should be our Vindicator. Waiting on you, Commander. And if I kind of jump up to say... That's a side shot. We're there. That's not a great shot, but it's in the back. It gives us some high ground. Commencing alpha strike. Yeah, we did crap. We did absolutely nothing there. <laughs> Despite ignoring all the evasion and everything else, we did nothing. Oh well. It is what it is. Another long way here. All right. Take a shot at the Warhammer, because why not? I didn't even take a drink of my drink. I'm so... You pick it up, and they're like, oh, something's happening. Oh, hey, another guy's getting go. That should be... Slowly whittling him down. We have to get one guy to survive this. Oh. I thought it said it was optional. Oh, maybe it still is optional. It doesn't have a... A deal around it, you know what I'm saying? And the awesome, at least, is still in the reasonable shape. Awaiting orders. Okay. Um, where? What am I on? I'm on my awesome. We can try to finish this guy off. We gotta, we gotta get people off the table. Copy that. Get people out of our backs. DT destroyed. All right, he's gone. Back destroyed. Out of our back. Off the board. Don't have to worry about him again. Now we just have to worry about the second star. Okay, they are, they're awesome. It's still in good shape. One more guy to move. And then our big guys, at least our slow guys, get to go. Three okay. All right, what's he got? He's got lasers. He's into that war hammer. Warhammer's still good, though. All he's lost is a machine gun so far. Hey. Get the Battlemaster up here. What do we got? We've got good shots at this Ryokin. Not as good a shot at the Puma. Uh, good shots at the Blackhawk, though. I think we go there. Right. Say two Clan ER PPCs. Less armor. I think he's our target this turn. Do they follow up? Yes, they do. Look at that Warhammer, man. He's just psychic. I point and he just follows. I like that. So we might be able to finish him off completely right here. I'm just not even going to go anywhere, I think. Enris, Puma, Dragonfly, Blackhawk. Here we go. He's still got a clan ER PPC, so he needs some help. Head hit, though, and a knockdown, and a shoulder. That's at least three injuries right now. And he's incapacitated. There we go. All right, so he's out. All right, they're going after the Awesome again. Oh, the Awesome, excuse me, is going after the Fenris. Okay, fair enough. Standing by. 
All right, who do I want with Ryoken? Uh, there, Ryoken. A pretty good target. Let's go. He's kind of out in the open. It, individual weapons don't scare me as much as some of the others, but he's got a lot. <laughs> so we may as well get him. What's the wasp going to do? He's going to go for the Puma. Puma's a good shot. He doesn't have a lot of armor. He's got some big guns. But I think either... As long as this guy's going to stand out here in the open for us, I think we've got to take the shot. Oh, he didn't get into any internal structure with that shot. That was crappy luck. And they put one after the awesome for evasion purposes, I guess. Order. Um, I'm going to move the Mad Cat up to here. Position. And let's see if we can get... Uh, the Ryokan has moved back a little bit. But I think we continue on. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. He's, he's going to be done this turn, I think. See what happens. I've been sensor -locked. He's just going to sensor lock. That's fine. We're okay with that. I hear you. Turn around. Let's see who we want. We've got a Fenris. We've got that Puma. And we've got the Ryokin. I think we go there. There we go. Hit with PPC. Put some missiles in there and got the knockdown. All right, so... I'm assuming either the Warhammer or the Awesome is going to finish him off. But we might have the next shot. Actually, we're going to have somebody else in three. So we'll see how that goes. We might have just pushed him into three with that shot. We've got the Puma. Warhammer. Ah, he is going to go fast. They're finally lost weapons. Okay, slide back up here. I don't think the action's gonna happen back over there by our Vindy. Dragonfly comes in. Oh! Went for a punch on the Warhammer. Okay. And he ejected. That's probably a fair. It's probably fair at this point. Um, quite the awesome up. What do we got going on? We've got reasonable, much better than reasonable, and that's not going to overheat us, and we're just going to finish it. We're not even going to leave it up to the, the awesome. There we go. 40%. Now, who do we want now? Who does the battle master want? We've got the Fenris over there. Actually, I got pretty decent shots at him. Um, or the Puma, who we've already put some damage on. I'm going to go CT, called shot on the Puma. Let's push him back a, a movement, as well as maybe get through that armor. Or just destroy him outright. Everything went CT, he's done. Beauty. All right. We might get two of their mechs out. We might get the awesome and the... And the wasp out. The other guy ejected, so in theory he's alive. Orders. Fenris. Dragonfly. Sorry, Fenris. Copy that. Okay, did a little bit. Not a huge amount, but something. Good to go. Come up here where I can. Where did I see I had it? Not unobstructed. We have good shots at both of them. See who we want. Fenris is okay. 56. 56 for both of them. Um, Dragonfly is just a pulse. I think that means we got... Well, he's not much either, to be honest. Roger. There we go. Wasp comes in and is like, yeah, got this. Got in on the dragonfly. I got a mosquito bite, like right between my knuckles. It's really annoying. Okay, who's next? They've only got two guys left. The one just gonna pop uh 
the sensor lock again. Yep. Oh, we didn't do anything. Okay. Um, let's walk up. Hit the shots at both with our mad cat. Um. Oh yeah. Yeah. Sorry, dragonfly. Well, he's got no more guns. Let's see what he does. Oh, and he's knocked down. Oh, he's unsteady. But the next shot will knock him down. I actually, unless it's his turn now, he could recover some of that. I think it's the other guy's turn now. Oh, dragonfly. What can I do for you? Put some shots out. Not much. A little something. A little something something. Commander. Oh here, let's let's stay back a little bit just because we got PPCs. I don't know if it matters that much for range, but um that will overheat us. That will overheat us. Let's um shut these down. What does he have CT? 31? Risk it. Well, it wasn't enough to kill him, but it was enough to scare him. So out he goes. I'm here. And we save some heat. I'm gonna walk the battle master on this side of the hill. Advancing, I guess. We'll get a shot at this guy. Copy that. Firing alpha strike. Okay, that was pretty reasonable. Lost his he's unsteady now, so the awesome should be able to put him on his butt. Oh, except he decided to entrench. Okay. Actually, I don't really have a problem with that. Move the Zeus up. I'm there. Direct but obstructed shot. Let's go ahead and turn off the medium lasers. Engage target. Come on, you want to leave, buddy? You probably should. Critical hit. No, he's stressed. He's... But he's not ready to go yet. I think the Rio can just stomp some here. Yep. Should have run, buddy. Should have run. All right, and we got our um, optional as well. We got two of them out. Three alive, two still in their mix. Not too bad. The only one that didn't come out was the stupid one. I really like the dynamic of additional lances or whether they be allied or whether they be, you know, three sides that are all hostile to each other. I really like that dynamic. More mechs on the battlefield. It slows things down a little bit like we saw there, but um, I think it's really fun. I really enjoy kind of thinking about that one. We didn't have much tactical. We just kind of sat there and crushed everything as it came around the hill for us, which is nice. Um, but, you know, we still took a little bit of damage. Zeus got hit. We have a little bit of a repair to take. Uh, we got a little bit of money. Let's see if we're going to keep anything. Um, all right. Potentially we could get a dragon. Oh, here, a dragonfly. But let's go ahead and go for the Fenris, right? Because we've got three parts of it. We've got one C. Um, we're going to take maybe the Prime, too, because I'm not sure. Looks like we have three parts, one of which is a C. The other two must be something else. So let's take the Prime. It'll just give us more options. And, you know, who knows? Maybe we get a dragonfly part as well, or two, and get more of this. Oh, we got a dragonfly. Nice. Um, and we got a black hawk and a puma. All right. Not too shabby. Hit continue and see how that turns out for us. We have some options. All right. So we can go with any of these. Of course, we don't know what any of them are. <laughs> but we got four options. We got one part of each. Let's see. If we air it mouse over, will it tell us? No. It will not. Um, you know what? I'm gonna take the prime, right? Because it's the prime. So I'm gonna go for it. It would be nice though if a mouse over here would tell us what these are. Um, otherwise I'd back out and just look mouse over them. But this one hasn't allow us hasn't been allowing us to put parts together, um, except here. Um, we have seen in the past um, with some mods that um, 
you could pass here and then rebuild it within the actual mech bay itself, but this one doesn't appear to last. So I'm just going to take the Prime. So we'll go Fenris Prime. Um, we'll go ahead and ready it. Uh, active probe at an ER PPC. Decent scout mech. Okay. So maybe this is our replacement for the Vindicator. So let's take a look at it. Get in here. Um, Fenris Prime. Uh, go ahead and repair this. And we'll go and we'll wait a day here for it to finish readying our uh, Fenris. All right. Mac Bay, let's hop in. And Fenris Prime, what do we got? Oh, I like the paint scheme. We'll stick with that. <laughs> All right, so it's a little 45 tonner, which is the same as our Vindicator, so that makes sense. ER PPC and streaks. Mm, I'm not a fan of the streaks. ER. Honestly, right now, I think our Vindicator is probably better. I mean, it does have the PPC, but it has to show itself to do anything, right? We might be better off just taking the Beagle off of this because it's only one ton and sticking it on the Vindicator. Because um, we've got an Eloclan LRM20 and a uh, ER PPC on that. And a lot of armor. Um, right now, it's not really seeing much here. And jump jets. I don't know. I'm not seeing the Fenris, guys. At least not this one. Um, and it doesn't have a lot of options. We could do one energy, one missile, and one laser. Now, we could swap all this out for, like, say, uh, you know, an ER SRM or LRM-20. You know, maybe a clan LRM-20 we could put in there. Because um, that weighs, what, five? And this is six. Uh, half a ton there. Seven and a half, eight and a half. So we get eight and a half tons back from that, and then do like a clan LRM twenty, and maybe like a medium pulse or an ER medium or something like that. Either way, it would be a drop in in, in output. Well, no, I don't. I think I'm not seeing this. I'm not sure I have a role for this. I mean, I know. I know it's a clan mech, <laughs> but I don't know it's a useful clan mech for me right now. I think the Vindy's better. Um, firepower is 155 versus 116. We've got jump jets. Now, it's very heat efficiency, but we don't care. Movement-wise, it's pretty quick. Movement, 210, uh, but no jumping. So whereas our movement here is 120, so it's it's twice as fast as us. That is significant, but it can't jump, uh, and that's a big deal. Um, durability, we've got 375 and 840, 376 and 720. I think the Vindicator's better. I think I'm just going to slide him down to here. Um, he's a decent backup for us, and maybe we take the Beagle probe off and we stick it on the Vindy. Uh, and we use it that way. That's not terrible. Um, or we wait to just get something else that's fast that we actually enjoy, think is better. Um, I think for the moment we do that. But I think what we can do is, we've got the Raven. I think I'm going to strip the Raven and the Panther. And then maybe... Now, there's not really anything we're stripping off of this. I'm wondering if we just sell them. Tag might not be a bad idea. Do we have room for it on here? And we have more energy. We could go, we don't ever run out of ammo. Well, that's not true. Um, we could put a tag on there. We'd have to lose another ton of ammo, though. We could lose the heat sink. Because we're not probably going to fire the ER, PPC, and the LRM-20 all that often. But we could lose a heat sink, or the AMS for that matter, actually. That's probably what to lose. If we were to lose the AMS, that gives us one and a half tons. And then we could put the tag on here. And potentially the Beagle as well, lose another half ton of ammo, but be fine. I kind of like that idea. Let's look at that. So if we go, let's confirm. Yeah. I'm going to 
think I'm going to put the Fenris in storage. That should strip it, right? So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to put the Raven in storage. And then I'm going to put the Panther in storage. And then I'm going to come to my Vindicator. I'm going to refit here. And I'm going to get rid of the AMS. Maybe we'll put it on something else. Um, I'm going to get rid of the heat sink. And now I'm going to go to equipment. And weapons energy, right? No. Yeah, is the tag an energy weapon? Here's the tag. And then we want the beagle. The beagle should be here though, right? But is it is it attached? Is there something we can't ah we might not be able to do anything with it? Um might be part of the chassis. You know, like our uh PPC there. Although we could put this on instead. Ah, uh, that weighs six. Oh, I might as well get my heat sink back. And can we do another jump jet? Now we only have four jump jets. Um, so that leaves us a half ton, but we could get armor back. Do something like that. And again, maybe we put the AMS on somebody else. Maybe on one of the big guys, the Awesome or the Zeus or something like that. Maybe we find an extra ton for it. But we'll worry about that in the future. Um, that's a shame. You know, I really... That Fenris is just not useful for us, I don't think. Um, and we'll just kind of have to keep our eye out. So we're still running, too. We still got the real We still got the Mad Cat. And uh, we will see you next time. So thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you later. Cheers.